Campaign dollars raised for the CACO campaign will add to his already ample war chest. More than five months before the general election, the Republican has far more money in the bank than either potential Democratic opponent. We dug deeper into federal campaign records to see if having more money means certain victory. John Katko quit his job as a federal prosecutor in 2014 with no money in a campaign account. He was challenging incumbent Democrat Dan Maffei, who was trying to win his third term in office. By November, Maffei had spent more than $2.7 million. The political newcomer spent just over $1 million, but also benefited from ads paid for by third-party groups. He won by a wide margin. The next campaign, the tables had turned. The power of incumbency helped John Katko spend more than $2.4 million. His opponent that year was Democrat Colleen Deacon. She had enough support to spend nearly a million and a half dollars. Congressman Katko handily won that second term. For 2018, the Republican again has a major head start on fundraising over two Democrats who will face off in a primary next week. Katko has $1.3 million on hand. Dana Balter, just over 100000 and Juanita Perez-Williams, just over 56000 Whichever Democrat comes out ahead next week will have to immediately start raising money.